Well, good afternoon, everybody. Beautiful 70 degrees in Las Vegas, Nevada. Now, this is why people won't admit to this. It's why we live here. Not the three months that is 120 plus or, or two months. Um, sorry, I'm just getting... Hopefully, you guys can see me here. I'm trying to get in a uh, comfortable spot. Look at me with a t-shirt on over here. Unbelievable. Uh, hey, if you're new to my channel, consider on uh, subscribing. Hit the subscribe button right now. Um, I keep the latest latest updates on unemployment, POA, California, Nevada, and now some other states that I'm getting some information in. And talk a little bit about cigars and everything that's on your mind. Um, Got to stay motivated, people. And people who have been subscribing, let me say thank you very much. Um, it's greatly appreciated. Um, if I can uh, help you out with some information, it's my pleasure. Now, let me just get in another spot here. Because this sun's been being a pain in the ass. I almost broke my ass. All right, so we'll get right to it. Uh, latest news. Now, uh, I'm going to start with the stimulus first. I'm hearing a lot more talk. I was in a meeting today for about 45 minutes. A lot more talk now that um, um, the next administration, Joe Biden, is going to continue. Remember I said this? You can look. At, go ahead and look at my old videos, people. Who said it? It was 14 hours in addition to the 600. So it's still not a slam dunk. There's still talks in my throat. But it looks and lo looks look looking like it's going to be the 1400. They gave out the 600, and hopefully most of you's gotten it because tomorrow is the deadline. We'll talk about that in a minute. Um, so um, he wants to go ahead as soon as he gets in within his first 48 days or excuse me 48 hours. Sorry about that. He wants to do a. Uh, I'm just reporting to news people. I, I I'm. Just going right down the middle here, that he wants to do the fourteen hundred dollars uh, each each person, and he wants to also throw in uh, two thousand dollars for a child who was going to college. Remember, they didn't get anything, and I I I, I I I tell it as it is. I agree on that one with him. So I think it's not right. There's people out there that uh, kids are in school and they why, why can't they get anything? They need. I guess the only thing I think of is they were getting student loan assistance, but so he's going to throw that in. And um, so it'll be fourteen hundred dollars. Now this is for unemployment. Pay attention. Hope you're going to hear from me first. You might hear from somebody else, but you want from me. But I'm I'm getting it as I speak here. They're going to extend the unemployment. They're going to boost it to four hundred dollars. Is what I'm reading. Okay, until September. Didn't say when in September, but a four hundred dollar boost, meaning a hundred dollars in addition to the three hundred. And then, um, like I said, fourteen hundred dollars stimulus is what he's going to try to pursue. In his first 48 hours in office. What are you saying? Yeah. In case you're wondering, you cigar smokers are tuning in. I know I haven't talked about much cigars, so just let me throw this in real quick. Um, this is a Vegas cigar. And if I told you what it's like wine or beer or anything else, I got a five pack of these cigars for $10.50. Uh, I tell it as it is. A lot of you who know me, maybe even see my posts on Facebook and Twitter. Excuse me, Twitter. Uh, Facebook and Instagram. I'm fussy. I like high-end cigars, or you know, I like the, not not all the time, but I like to get this cigar is like a fifteen-dollar cigar. It's called Vegas One Red Wrapper. Excellent. Uh, just a good cigar all the way through. Medium body, uh, a little earthy. So I'm gonna finish up this cigar with this video, and then um, so all right. So now I'm gonna get back to it. So now still having problems. News here on um, fraud. Um, still 1.4 million people in California. They froze the accounts. Still not un un ugh. unlocking the accounts for those people. They're suffering for the bad guys. Unreal. Uh, it's just a mess in California. It's still a mess here in Nevada. I hear from a, um, a subscriber, and thank you, um, not mentioning any names, that Georgia has some problems. I guess they're going to possibly protest. They still haven't gotten, uh, um, I wasn't aware of this. But an individual here was letting me know, and um, I got some information on that if you're listening or if you watch this video later, actually. Can't go live. Um, yeah, they're having some problems. I, I They still haven't got anything. I could tell you some good news. I hear that they're actually um, finalizing, is what I'm hearing from a um, um, someone who works for the, one of the senators here in the government office. Uh, that he told me what he knows in Georgia. They're trying to finalize the learning the language. So they're trying to just figure out, do they need a uh, fellow in Georgia, Atlanta, uh, to go ahead and reapply for POA and regular unemployment, or are they just going to do the extension? I don't understand why 
here's my whole thing. When a state is having a problem like this, I don't know if Georgia had a problem in the beginning, but I know Nevada did. Why don't they just take a look at other states? Every state, it should be simple. It really should, people. I, I, you have a problem, look at some other states. What language is you understanding? I, I, it's this easy thing. If people have been applying for unemployment, give them the extension. Uh, if they're working part-time, have a row for earnings. And that's it. Uh, for new, I could see maybe it would take an extra day or two just for new applicants that are coming on board. Perhaps new uh, people for POA. But add their credentials. I don't understand the problem. Um, but I'm sorry to hear that. I really am. I, I know what you're going through because... When it came out, my business suffered. We, I was one of the, you know, I didn't get apply until maybe June, and it was just and my wife, and I was just fortunate. I that's when I start using my voice. Well, I was using my voice in the beginning, but um, I can tell you in Nevada, there's still people who haven't gotten paid. People are watching this video now and just shaking their head. Yep, that's me. Uh, and some of it is fraud here, but yeah. So Georgia is what I'm hearing, and they're trying to learn the language and get it situated. But yeah, what's your opinion, Georgia? Voice your opinion. Uh, call your political leaders. You you vote them in. Whether you're Democrat or Republican, you vote them in. You pay their salaries. Voice it. Call your contact, your local news. If you're a person who likes to talk like I do, talk. Tell them you're fighting. You're fighting for everybody. You're dire straits. We need. You know this is this is not our fault. Remind them. And just they know that. But just just force the pressure on them. You know. So. Um, it is amazing you know they get their they get their seats and and everything and then and senate and house and this is both sides people and then they sit back and uh they, they, they don't care anymore so um sorry to hear that in georgia uh, i also hear puerto rico where my wife is from is also having some problems and now they were last time it's so funny because they were on board quicker so i don't get it people I don't understand all right so um i hear that um that um there is now rental assistant there's a portal you can go on each state you go on to to the covid 19 you go into your state for an example if you're in nevada if you're in florida and you type it in they're going to want a profit loss so in other words if you haven't been working um I, I don't I don't get it, but they want a profit loss. So they I guess if you're collecting unemployment, you had to be collecting unemployment, but they don't want a profit loss of your business if you're a POA. So um, profit loss, you know, and also after taxes which you made. So they're making this a little bit of complicated again, this is rental assistance people, sorry. I got distracted a little bit, I had a bird fly in front of me. <laughs> um, but yeah, this is for rental assistance. So um, yeah, um, they want to have a profit loss of your business, a, a tax, uh, hopefully a tax, but yeah, you can probably do it yourself. It shouldn't take that long. And then a, um, what you're making after taxes, um, your net profit. So I assume reading some of this language, if you're on unemployment, just accordingly go by what you're making for unemployment. Um, it are making this again, just like they did with POA and unemployment. Why are they making it so complicated? This was not anybody's fault but uh, at least there is now a portal you can go on and get some assistance i'm still hearing that they're only going to give two months but that each state is different so go on there type in a covid19 rental assistance um and it should have some information on there so you can click on i i understand that you everything's email you can't call at least here in nevada sorry that you have to go ahead and email and then they'll get back to you within 24 hours i'm hearing they are getting back to you and then give them over some proof of identity, uh, social security, driver's license, that kind of stuff. All right. Um, I don't agree with it. I'm just reporting what I'm hearing. I think it shouldn't be that. It should just be show some proof that you're on unemployment, uh, proof that you're late on your on your on your rent uh, due to um, the pandemic. It's not that you know you stepped away from business. I guess you know and it wasn't like the economy was great and you stepped away. I, I don't know. The money's there. It's in a package. Why are they? It, it, to me, I'm wondering if. Maybe they don't have enough for everybody and it's first come, first serve, and it's not right. But people, you got to work at this. And it's not fair, but you got to take a day or two and just make the calls or the emails and do it. I covered food assistance, and that's not as bad. Not as much, uh, um, um, you don't have to, it's just pretty much shown proof of your income and unemployment, and they approve it. And it's not 
long-term food assistance. I'm referring to SNAP, but it's a couple months. But not not as not as I'm not going to say strict, but it's just it's a little easier. All right. And then the PPP, I'm hearing some bad news on that now that people are still getting turned down, and and it's just a mess. I I don't know. They worked they, they worked out the unemployment for mo- most states, for exception of somebody just talked about, but. Um, I don't know. We'll see what happens now with this next stimulus. Uh, again, that's what I'm hearing. I'll repeat. If you just want to go right through this video, it's $1,400 they're working on the Biden administration and then um, extending the unemployment boost uh, from 300 to 400 starting in March to September. Okay? Latest news. Listen, people. Tomorrow's another day. Stay focused. Um, one day at a time. People, you got to take a deep breath sometimes you really do and we only can control so much i'm one who there's voice your opinion speak up but we only can do so much let's not worry about what you're hearing on the, you know are we going to have this is this going to happen a civil war fights and crimes you you should wake up in the morning okay and 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 thank somebody for being alive okay whether you thank god or your Uncle Vinny, or I don't care, somebody, right? Thank yourself. Um, you should, as soon as you wake up, you should say, I'm going to have a great day. This is going to be a great day, a great, unbelievable day. Think good things going to happen. I'm going to get through to the unemployment. Things are going to work out. Put it, people, and some of you might be shaking your head, yeah, you're full of shit. No, what are you going to do? Wake up and say, I'm going to have a shitty day. It's just going to be a fucked up day. I'm just going to lay in bed. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to... Business is going to go worse. It's worse. And the world's going to hell. No, people. Let's not get caught up into that. So share this video. Let's say it's going to be a beautiful day. And, and think positive. We're all... People are having struggles. Nothing's perfect. You look over. The grass is not green on the other side. But you got to work. If, if you don't think positive And you feel... We're human. We're going to feel have bad days but i'm not saying it but wake up and reach deep down inside and and just a little meditation simple meditation and say it's gonna be great it's gonna be great let me let me brush my teeth put some water on my face drink my coffee my orange juice whatever you drink have a cigar whatever you do in the morning do some jumping jacks i don't care i'm gonna be a fantastic day and a fantastic week and thank you for being here on this earth and i'm gonna fight to the end think like that okay a little motivation tip okay we want from me. That's all I can tell you. All right, people. Um, I'll be on later on if I hear any more. But, yeah, it's looking very promising on stimulus. So, um, Georgia, I'm so sorry to hear that. Uh, if I get more information, I will um, I'll do another video or I'll leave another comment. Take care.